Hi everyone, uh, how are you? Uh, welcome to Movie at Tuesdays with uh, ABD Things. Uh, uh, this is my sister. Hello. So, uh, let's go to the show. Uh, Justice League. Uh, uh, totally Zack Snyder's cut. That means there's no interference from the company or whatever. And uh, I really loved it. Yep, me too. I really loved it. What do you like about this version of... Okay, uh, so I watched the short version of Justice League and also the... Now I've just watched the four hour full movie of Justice mm, League. Mm. So in the four hours Justice League, I love that uh the story was very detailed mm-hmm. so even though people who have never watched justice league before never watched man of steel or anything before mm-hmm. when they watch this four hours movie they can understand actually what is happening i feel it was a four hour long movie i didn't have my bathroom breaks or my butt didn't crack yeah so our like, whole family we were yeah. watching it even my father we were like watching it for four hours yeah. and none of us like got out of our seat yeah. and go and see or do something else. We were just watching the movie for the whole four hours without any break at all because it was so good. It was basically DC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It yeah, was DC. It was, it, it it was, was a DC. real DC movie actually. See. I like that they gave much space to Cyborg this time. Oh, yes. yes Cyborg. Yes, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I believe that Stephen Wolf was much stronger in this movie. Then Dark Side, yes. Stephen Wolf looked mightier than yeah. Dark Side. Yes. I, I really liked him and his suit was I think he suit. yeah, he he borrowed from Wonder Woman 1980 or something like that, I think. <laughs> it looks really shiny on him and I like I really like the suit. It was yeah, this, nice. This this suit was good. Yeah. From the beginning, the continued the way he continued from uh, the Dawn of Justice, Batman v Superman. Mm-hmm. I think I really like that part. Like every role like every flash and like uh cyborg uh, <laughs> aquaman wonder everyone woman everyone had their standalone moment yeah which yeah yeah that's really, what I, yes, really yes, good. yes yeah yes. another thing that we liked about the movie was uh surprisingly jared leto's uh joker yeah <laughs> he was in the movie sorry spoilers but like i'm a fan of joker like the so like the appearance of joker was like oh. really it was not like suicide squad i did not anticipate joker's yes appearance in the movie because i thought that it would be another movie where he comes and everything all the stuff but to see joker in this movie was like dang yeah okay um what we felt was uh, a bit drawback in the film was um batman I had Batman <laughs> fan I felt that uh he was just pushed around a lot yeah. in the movie he felt very powerless in the movie I think okay another thing was uh yes is a uh, Zack Snyder's version but yet some of these dialogues uh humors were I think it was forced yeah it was forced uh, I felt like they were trying to do something like trying to do something new like the other movies from other companies yes but yeah no uh, offense yeah, no, no offense. offense but i felt like this movie uh he the dialogues wasn't powerful yeah. as much yeah said another sad thing about this is like it i really don't think so it will continue right yeah, we won't be sad yeah thing about it because Yeah the like, like you said like definitely they're supposed to be like it's another, a sequel actually yeah two. yeah definitely it's supposed to be that because of the ending but since you know it's Sadly, Snyder's first so we don't think a second one will come so it's a must watch to all uh, comic book fans like we really really love the movie because uh the story the story is good yes the story the story is good it's exactly the same as comic book and the way he took it and everything was good like this is good yeah okay so uh we highly recommend this movie please do watch it rethink about it um and let us know in the comments below until then take care bye